Hello everyone. My name is Sumit Goyal and I welcome to all of you to BIFPTraining.com. I am a Salesforce subject matter expert and today I am going to tell you that how to create workflow on a particular object in a Salesforce and uh, which will send a birthday birthday email to a candidate on his or her, her birthday. So this is my business requirement. So I would like to create a workflow that can send birthday email to candidates on your birthday. Now for this, first of all, we'll need to calculate the next birthday of the candidate based on the birth date, and then we'll be going to create a time trigger workflow, and that time trigger workflow will be executed on his next birthday automatically, and it will send an email or birthday email to that candidate. So the formula which we'll be going to use to calculate the next birthday is I have mentioned over here. So this is the formula. So I will be going to use the same formula to calculate the next birthday of a particular candidate. So let's move on to Salesforce. As you can see here, we have candidate records over here. And when I click on any candidate number, you can see we have date of birth, but we do not have any next birthday field over here. So first of all, I am going to create a new formula field over here that will calculate or that will display the next birthday date of this particular candidate. So for this, let's create a new field or as a formula field. So I click on new field over here and the type will be formula type because it will be a read only field and it will display the next birthday date. Click on next and here next birthday and the return type will be date type next so this is a formula so I'll copy paste this formula over here now you have to be careful about the fields which we'll be going to use here so this is basically custom field which is another candidate object so we can check this <coughs> so date of DOB underscore underscore C this is safe okay you can click on check syntax also to check whether the syntax is okay or not the syntax is okay no error found click on next and again next and at the end you can click on save so it will create a field in the candidate object custom field basically it's a custom field over here formula and if you click on any candidate it will display the next birthday date over here so as you can see here this candidate next birthday is 11 11 2015 because the 11 11 has already passed few days ago so now it will be displaying the next birthday date so next birthday is it now it will the next birthday will come next year in 2015 now i will be going to create a workflow on this candidate object so before creating a workflow i will need to set up an email template or birthday email template so that and that email template will basically to send an email so for this click on setup communication template click on email template new template HTML using letterhead we have already designed letterhead so that I already shown in my previous video how to design a letterhead for, an, for a company so you can refer to my previous video M make it available for use and email template name is birthday email template letterhead BSP letterhead email layout is preform letter and click on next now what will be the subject subject will be happy birthday and here what will be the content content will be dear and candidate name so to display the candidate name we want to, we would like that this the candidate name should populate automatically so I'm going to select over here candidate field and from here I will be going to select first name display here first name last name last name and the custom message wish you a very Happy birthday from BISP team.
and next click on copy from text html html version click on save so template is created now we'll be going to create workflow on this candidate object so to create a workflow we need to click on setup create and under create we have workflows and approvals so i check workflow rules click on new rule now i would like to create a workflow on candidate so i click on candidate click on next rule name birthday rule now i would like to what will be the evaluation criteria evaluation criteria means uh, created and every time it is edited but i would like to evaluate uh, means i would like to execute this every time so created and every time uh, but the issue is if i if we choose the second one we cannot create time dependent workflow and we need to create time dependent workflow so we cannot select the second option we will choose the third option and the criteria will be i set the criteria where the formula values to true and true it means it will execute this workflow every time click on save and next now you see we have two section immediate workflow action and time dependent workflow action i don't want immediate workflow action because this will work only one time i would like to create a time dependent workflow action it will work every year automatically i would like that the workflow action should auto execute automatically if it meets a criteria so i click on add time trigger now i would like this workflow rule to be executed on the zero days before the candidate next birthday it means whenever is the candidate next birthday this rule will execute automatically and this this time trigger will execute and it will do uh, it will perform some action click on save now what action this will do or this time dependent workflow will do so we need to add an action from here i add new email alert birthday email email template so the in this we'll be going to select the template which we have created or designed birthday email template now who will be going to who will be the recipient type so recipient type will be the email field so i select email field from here click on save so the time dependent action has been created and the workflow action has been created over here click on done and activate it now to check this rule whether this rule is working or not what will be going to do is i will be going to create a new record over here as my name and i will be going to enter my records over here so i enter my records over here let's suppose my date of birth is today's i enter today's date so that it will execute today mobile number and email i'll i'm going to enter my email id and save the record so the the record has been saved so the next birthday is on 27 11 2014 so if i'll move on to my email id or if i move on to my mailbox i will receive that email i'm waiting for the email so once so the work has been done and it will take time to execute so the process will be done in the background and uh, we'll receive an email soon so let's see whether the email has been received or not so as you can see here i have received an email from bisp team that dear my name is over here wish you a very happy birthday from bisp team regards bisp so i received an email on this following mail id and this is on on my birthday So this is how we can create a workflow or time trigger workflow which will send an email on the birthday of a particular candidate. So that's all in my video. If you have any question and answer, you can send an email to us or you can subscribe our YouTube channel to visit our videos to check our videos on different topics. That's all. I will coming up with some new videos with new topics.
Till then, have a nice day ahead. Good day.